Repair Clinic encourages you to perform this procedure safely. In this video, we will show one or more of these icons to alert you when to use caution. Before you replace the throttle cable on your edger, first make sure the engine has cooled. Next, remove the wire and boot from the spark plug to prevent the engine from accidentally starting. Use a T25 Torx bit screwdriver to remove the screws securing the throttle cable to the airbox. Note the location of the Z end of the cable on the throttle plate, then detach the cable. Now, remove the screws securing the two halves of the edger handle together. Pull off the bottom half of the handle. Remove the throttle cable from the trigger assembly and detach the handle tube clamp to fully release the cable. You're now ready to install the new throttle cable. Secure the new cable under the tube clamp. Then attach the barrel end to the trigger as you align the cable in the handle. If necessary, you can realign the trigger on the handle by depressing the spring and pushing the trigger into place. Realign the bottom half of the handle and replace the screws to secure. Attach the Z end of the throttle cable to the appropriate hole in the throttle plate. Insert the cable into the slot in the air box and replace the screw to secure. With the repair completed, reattach the spark plug wire and boot and your edger should be ready for use.